Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a common question that many Python enthusiasts encounter when working with NumPy arrays. Our viewer wants to know how to extract the two smallest values from an array, but they're running into a pesky error when using the np.where function. Let's dive into the details and find out how to solve this problem together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, going through some of the answers, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy and work through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. To extract the two smallest values from a NumPy array, we first need to understand the error you're encountering. The error occurs because you're trying to unpack more values than are available. Instead of using np.where, we can use the numpy function np.partition, which allows us to efficiently find the smallest values without sorting the entire array. Here's how you can implement this. First, import numpy, then create your array. After that, use np.partition to get the two smallest values. This code will give you the two smallest values from the array. Note that the original order of the array is not preserved, but you will get the correct smallest values. Finally, you do not need to arrange the numbers in ascending order to find the smallest values. The np.partition function handles that for you. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To find the two smallest values in a NumPy array, you can use the sorted function. Simply sort the array and select the first two elements. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To get the two smallest values from a NumPy array, first ensure your slice is correct. Instead of using 0, 1, you should use 0, 2. Also, remember that np.where returns a tuple, so you need to access the first element before indexing the array. If there aren't two indices with the minimum value, you might encounter an exception, so it's a good idea to check for that. And that's it, guys. I hope this video helped find that resolution you're looking for and you found the answer. Guys, please hit subscribe if it helped, and I'd really appreciate it. I'll see you next time on another one of these technical videos. Have a good one.